Hey guys, Trevor here. And in this video, I'm gonna help you fix if you're getting the message, Safari can't connect to the server. It's pretty quick and easy, so let's jump right in. Now, you might be getting a message that looks like this, Safari can't connect to the server, Safari can't open this web page because Safari can't connect to the server. I'm gonna walk you through several different options you have in terms of getting that working and getting it working so that you can connect to the server and to a whatever web page you're using and move on. So let's get out of here and the first thing that we're gonna to want to do is to go into our settings here. When we're in settings, we will scroll down until we find Safari and we'll tap on Safari and then again, we'll scroll down to the very bottom and you can see where it says clear history and website data. We'll tap on that and hit clear history and website data. So this will clear all of the cookies and the cache on Safari because potentially there's something corrupted that's causing you to not be able to access a certain web page. So once we've done that, the next step that you'll want to take let's get back out of here and hit on general and then we will hit on date and time and here you want to make sure that it's set automatically so make sure that you don't have the date and time to an older date or a future date that can cause issues with connecting to servers for various websites and cause safari not to work very well so make sure set automatically is toggled on so that it has the current date and time and then it's accurate. Once you've done that, the next step that we can go through is let's get back out of here and we can go to general again and scroll down until we find transfer or reset iPhone. So we'll tap on that and we'll tap reset and reset network settings. So resetting our network settings will help to clear out any kind of bugs that might be in our network connection to the Wi-Fi or cellular network. And by resetting that, that usually helps with a lot of internet connection issues and could help with this server issue. The very next step that we'll do is we'll just open up Safari and make sure our internet is fast enough to load the page. So run, go to Google, type in speed test and hit run speed test. Check to see how fast your internet is. If it's faster, faster than five or 10 megabytes per second, then it's fast enough to be able to load that web page, and you shouldn't be getting that server, can't connect to server issue. Now, once you've gone through this step and made sure that you have internet and you've reset the network settings, the last step that you can do is just to restart your phone. So tap and hold the volume up and the power button and slide to power off there. And then once you power it off, just restart it and that should reconnect to any kind of cell network or Wi-Fi and you should be able to connect to any web page. Hope this helps. Let us know if you have any questions in the comments below and make sure to subscribe. Thanks.